All right, Shalom. First and foremost of all, praise and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakakwadash. The Bible the Apostles, the great most known teaching us, the warm sent truth according to the Bible and rule well, and peace and blessings so flood to the nation of Israel, take the spirit and power of Yahweh Shemal Shai. Yeah, I'm going to get a you know, quick, you know, to the point lesson. You know, I heard this quote the other day. You know, I mentioned it in my last lesson. It's not about what you can get. It's about what you become. You know, in this truth, you know, we're not here to get fame. We're not here to get anything or, you know, receive anything per se. We're, we're here to become those new creatures that Yahweh Shema Shai has commanded us to to, 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 to mold and, and to, to fashion ourselves after, right? Uh, that, 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 you know, I got a priest that come to, come to mind. Let me get it. This is uh, Matthew's, I'm sorry, Romans 12 and 1. I beseech you, therefore, brethren, by the mercies of the Most High, that you present your body a living sacrifice right so we have to present our bodies to Yahweh Shema Shai as a living sacrifice willing to uh, offer ourselves up you know offer up time willing to give up things willing to uh, uh, go through uncomfortable situations because what you will become not not because what you're necessarily going to get out of it you know in the time being you know in this truth we uh we have learned to not deal with instant gratification you know we've learned to become uh we've come to understand you know delay delayed gratification and understanding ultimately who you become you know becoming a, a, a better man you know these these things far exceed you know any accolades that the world uh, this world can can offer you any uh, type of uh, dollar amount, any type of uh, you know uh, whispering of the ears from women, right? What you become is what's important, and, and what we're trying to, to fulfill the shoes of are the men of of the men of Yahweh by Shema Shai. You know, uh, John the Baptist. You know, he spoke of Yahweh Shai. He said, "Whose shoes uh, I'm not worthy to bear." You know, the path that Yahweh Shai had to walk was a heavy walk, you know, and for, you know, Lord's more part of that number, the joint heirs, the 144,000, the men, you know, and the rest of the elect, you know, we, we have to wear shoes that, that two thirds of our people are not worthy to bear, you know, so, so it's the, it's the, it's the grind. It says, I beseech you, therefore, brethren, by the mercies of Yahweh, that you present your body a living sacrifice, right? A living sacrifice, holy, acceptable unto the Most High, which is your reasonable service, right? So what we're doing, you know, our, our, our acts, you know, who we're striving to become, you know, these things uh, then make us acceptable in the eyes of Yahweh by Shema Shai. And, and who will be able to stand in that day if you ain't accepted by the King of King and Lord of Lords when he comes back with the holy angels to judge Babylon the Great and to, and to, and to pour upon you the indignation of the Heavenly Father? You see? It says, And be not conformed to this world. But be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind. So don't be uh, uh, with the fashion of this world. So like you give me a second. It says, and be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind. Right, so this is what we've commanded to, been commanded to do, and, and that is our reasonable service. Right, that's the least that we can do, as Yahweh Shema Shai has granted us a new life. You see, uh, do something about it. You know, fight the good fight of faith. You know, lay hold on to eternal life. Don't let this thing go, because this is the best thing. You know, uh, 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 best thing in, in in America going for us, right? No opportunity, nothing is going to be better 
than 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 the than uh this knowledge, this wisdom, this understanding, right? And, and everyone's uh, about gain and, and 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 worrying about what they can get out of this system, you know, out of this world. Well, what can you what what can you become, you know, by repenting? What can you become by by uh going? Uh, by making the sacrifice and, 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 and not appeasing the flesh and, and feeding the spirit. Who, who will you become by, by fasting more? You know, by praying more. You know, by watching more videos, studying, reading more. Who, who are you going to become? You know, it's not about knowing the precepts so you can bring this precept out so you can cut somebody. You know, this truth is, uh, is, is more than that. It says, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind that ye may prove what is that good and acceptable, and acceptable will of the Most High. Right? It says, for I say, through the grace given unto me to every man that is among you, not to think of himself more highly than he ought to think, but to think soberly, according as the Most High have dealt every man the measure of his faith. So every man's been given, you know, a, a, a measure of faith. You know, everyone has their gift, and and you should you should perfect that gift. You know, whatever you're good at, you you should go hard. You know, if you're into the herbs, you you should you should you know you should be up there. You know, if, if you're into the Hebrew, you're right. If, if you're into agape, brotherly love, charity. Right, going into the history, you you should be mastering your craft because that's your gift that you bring to the body, right? And and it's not what you can get out of it, you know, in the sense of oh praise of men and you know people liking the video. No, it's who you become. You become someone who's honorable, you know. You you're coming someone who in, in the eyes of Yahweh by Shemal Shai is respected, you know. And, and we're looking for the respect that comes from the king. Um, you know, this lesson went a little. I want to get uh, another precept, but let's go. I believe this is Proverbs twenty-two and twenty-nine. Yep, it says, "See, is thou a man diligent in his business? You see, a man that's diligent, you know, that's doing the work, you know, that's laboring. See, is thou a man diligent in his business? This is the heavenly Father's business, you know, uh, and, and we ain't just here for a, a paycheck." You know, no, we're here for the, 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 like the apostles say, it ain't just about the destination. It's the journey. You have to enjoy the journey because of all your uh, call up on this, the destination. I can't wait till we get there. I can't wait till we get there. You know, uh, hope deferred, make up the heart sick, you know, but if you enjoy the, the journey <laughs> and enjoy the process of growth, you know, enjoy the process of who you're becoming, a, a new man, a new creature. You know, it, it's all the more better. It says, See, is thou a man diligent in his business? He shall stand before kings. Right? The king of kings, the Lord, Lord. You know, you're going to stand before kings. He shall not stand before mean men. The, you know, mean meaning average. Now, we're, we're going to be, we're going to stand before kings. And we're going to be exalted. I was thinking about this scripture earlier. I believe it's Ecclesiastes um, uh, seven and nine. Um, talks about I have seen servants upon horses. Yeah, I've seen uh, horses, um, servants upon horses, and and, and prince. I have seen um, yep servants upon horses and princes sitting. You know, and walking. So right now. The, the rich is sitting in a low place, you know, the ones with the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of the scriptures, you know, the elect of Yahweh by Shema Shah, we're, we're sitting in that low place, but, but, but in due season, if we faint not, we shall, we shall, we should be exalted, right, let me, um, get one more scripture, and, um, we'll go ahead and close it out, I think, I believe it's in um actually uh, in Galatians, not in um Ephesians five and seventeen. I thought it was Ephesians five and nineteen. Let me see. Maybe I overlooked it. Nope. Um let's type in new creature. 
Okay, Galatians and 2 Corinthians. All right, good to know. This is uh, Galatians 5. I'm sorry, Galatians chapter 6. Yep, uh, Galatians chapter 6 and... 15 for in Yahweh Mashiach neither circumcision availeth nor uncircumcil uncircumcision but a new creature and as many as walk according to this rule peace be unto you and mercy and upon the Israel of the most high right so we're we're striving to be those new creatures to to be called a uh, uh, the Israel of the Most High, right? What, 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 what love, right? What manner of love have, yeah, this is a first John 3 and 1. Behold, what manner of love the Father hath bestowed upon us that we should be called the sons of God. Therefore, therefore the world knoweth us not because it knew him not, Right? So who you we're we're, we're going to be called the sons of God, right? The elect of Yahweh by Shema Shai. And 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 that's that's who we are becoming, right? But we are not there yet. We still make mistakes, we're still in the flesh, you know? It's not about what you can get right now. You know, it's about who you're going to become, right? And then we're going to get the women. Then we're going to get the fame and the glory and the honor, right? But but now it's about who who are you becoming, right? You gotta become that new creature, uh, unrecognizable. This when when people see who is that, you know what wh what do you like to do? You you like to do oh oh you know, you know those those are those new creatures. But with that, you know, Lord is willing to edify. To next time, we say shalom.